I don't know. But Dark, I think Dark Knight's gonna ban that. Share that one with Congo 64. Come on, Brandon. Congo 64 is going to help out Sheridan a lot. Samus doesn't have to grapple recovery here. That's not that. Sage is awfully big, so uh, killing Jigs is going to be a little bit of a problem. And having a Jigs that survives a long time sucks. Beyond like anything you can ever imagine. Definitely. Could you imagine if like Mango lived each stock to 180? <laughs> yeah, that would suck. Baby. Yes. Uh oh, duh, duh. Shake it up. up. That's what I was talking about right there. It's hard to grapple. It's hard to get pull that ledge. And this one, the thing I like about watching Sheridan play is that when he loses, counter picks like the best stage. He like, always does. He always City, does. Congo, Dreamland, maybe Bristol. It's like he analyzes what the match, like what just happened in the match, and he does it so fast. Beyond like any player I've ever seen. He knows his stage. He knows what works for Jigs. Yeah. Where you at, Hungry Box? <laughs> Hungry Box. Man. Wow, fast get out of the grab. Shannon almost lives, but a little too much West Coast today. Uh, nice. I like the stuff that Dark Mike's putting together. The guy's pretty good. Yep, there's, there you go again. When, um, for Samus, when he has a charge shot, uh, Dark Mike. When Dark, when, uh, for Samus, when she has, when she has a charge shot, She'll usually just, like, actually, Dark Mike just tends to, like, jump up, randomly shoot it when he thinks you're going to jump. Yeah, when he thinks so, he's, he's good about that. So, it, not only does it catch you with a charge shot, but you also lose your jump, and you're usually off stage. So, you're really in an off-hit position. Basically, he gave you the business, fast and hard. You didn't see it coming. But Sheridan doesn't care. Look at him go to work. Damn, Sheridan. Damn, Damn Sheridan. Damn, Sheridan. Look, T, do you watch these videos? Because we make references. We make milk tea references all the time. It's because she's awesome. Alright, it's really good spacing by Sheridan again. It's not stopping. Alright, Dark Mike needs to get this skill. He needs to get it. I'm feeling Sheridan for this one. I don't see any comebacks. The thing about it is that I don't see a way Dark Mike can come back. Like, there's nothing for him to, like, really abuse on the stage. Yeah. FOD was really small, really, you know, it's it's a small stage with really small boundaries on the sides, which where which he was killing him off every time. But this stage, completely opposite. There's nothing he can really abuse. It's gonna, like, really... It's like that. It's really smart by doing that mini ch like mini charge, I guess, because uh, what he's doing is kind of he's faking Sheridan out. He's faking. He making wants him to approach. Him. Yeah. He uses it approach. to make an approach, and then he hits you. Approach right oh. into that up tilt. I thought Sheridan was gonna miss. I got excited. Back here. Let's go. Sheridan. Nice back air space. I wonder what stage. Dark Man's gonna go to if he loses this. Uh, Dreamland? Ouch. Got a bad save? No, no, I meant like what just happened. Ch shot the charge out the wrong way. Nice. Sheridan nice. has I learned. I think he went to the jump too. Sheridan has learned, ladies and gentlemen. He's jiggly buff, so it doesn't matter where he goes. He's learned how to get around that up tilt just a bit. Yeah, within one game. Impressive. That's what great players do, right? It is, yeah. If it, if he, like, if Sheridan learned the matchup just now, oh my God, Sheridan, your DI, let me just take it on a date. Let's go to Olive Garden. Too good. Congo, so is Congo. This is, this is what I was talking about earlier. When you have a Jigs that lives for a high percent, it just sucks. Yeah. Because you just feel like you're just wasting your time because he's also hitting you and adding percent. I like bet. That's it. Yeah. Alright. Alright, so third match. I